Johnny. You remember? From 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 the the Sekiro streams. Um, also, uh, Resident Evil. We, we we played Resident Evil together. Uh, while... Bloodborne. You you remember Bloodborne? Yes. Yeah, Johnny. Yeah. Hey. How how are you? Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ugh. Sorry about that. Uh, it's uh. Well, I'm still I'm I'm playing Sekiro, uh, so you you can you can watch, uh, watch watch along, uh, if you like. Uh, say some things. I won't see them, but if they're really good, well, maybe I will if they're really good. Um, and the mods are all like, oh, what a good comment. Uh, I don't know why. That was that was how I decided to characterise the mods. Uh, they'd be like, oh, what a good comment. That one was. Th that's Maddie. Yeah. It's classic Maddie. Um, uh, yeah, probably Yorkshire, Yorkshire, in Australia, York, Australia, York, York, Australia. Um, <laughs> Jester said, "Ooh, what a good comment!" Regular Bear, two thousand and three. Hi, chat. I just bought my first binder, and I'm really hyped about it. Cool. Right. I am going to play some Sekiro. I haven't played it in a week, uh, but you know what I found? Like, I found that it's always rough for the first like ten minutes, but like your fingers remember. Sekiro is one of those games. Like, I mean, it's not exactly easy the second time round, but like things like the, the that big ape that we that we killed, um, uh, that big ape we killed last week. Um, you remember uh, it? It flung some poo at us. Wasn't fun. Uh, but uh, oh, we killed our mate. Oh, that was nice for him. Um, anyway, yeah. Uh, like the first time round when I played it a few years ago, that took me like twenty attempts, and like maybe thirty, like maybe more. Like it was very much like just throwing yourself against a monkey-shaped wall. Um, for uh, well, an ape, an ape-shaped wall. Let's let's be, uh, let's let's not be. Um, but yeah, anyway. Uh, and this time it was like three attempts. I want to say maybe four. And it's just like it's your, like your fingers do remember. I guess that's one of the things about one of these games where like you do it so many times the first time round. That like it does lock in a certain degree of muscle memory. That said, now now I've now I've said all that stuff. Uh, watch me just get repeatedly destroyed. I found that flower for you. I asked Lady Emma about the sakura tree. You did. What did you say? I remember that, did I? Called an ever blossom. Lord Takeru brought it here from the divine realm, but it has withered away and no longer remains. I see. However, it is this is we're trying to from the we're trying to recreate the smell of heaven, like the divine realm where the dragon uh, is, so we can follow our nose uh, there, and then I can just beat up the divine dragon until it cries. I found a thing. I've procured the flower for the fountainhead aroma. Oh? Was it truly blooming in the sunken valley? Yes. Deep within the valley. So that is where the fountainhead waters pool deeply. You've done well to acquire this wolf. Oh, and actually, I found something. Oh? I discovered there's another scent we must acquire. Mm. What is it? The blood of the divine heir of the dragon's oh. heritage. In other words, my blood. Your blood, but my lord, you cannot bleed. Yes, it is true that those of the dragon's heritage cannot bleed. However, in Lord Genichiro's quarters, I found a curious. Sorry, I'm just to Lord legitimately watching because I'd forgotten all this. There is a way for me to bleed. For now, oh, oh good. I'd like to ask you to keep this for me. An old diary entry written by Takeru's page. Kero was the divine, uh, the divine lord before uh, Kuro. 
Lord Takeru held his arm over the incense burner and attempted to cut it with a sword, but incredibly his wound healed instantly and not a drop of blood was shed. Lady Tomo said, Without it, your blood cannot be skilled, spilled. What could she be referring to, I wonder? Now then, we just need to figure out how to make me bleed. Perhaps we should ask Lady Emma. Hmm. As a doctor, she should have much knowledge of the hmm? human What's... body. Yes. What does my shirt say? Oh, uh, oh, game is a bit too quiet. I can turn that up. Uh, to be fair, you're gonna, probably going to ask me to turn it down when we start uh, clashing swords. But uh, in fact, what I might do is sound voice up, sound effects down. That should do it. Um, yeah, my shirt says uh, C, the letter C, and then the festival. Uh, this is a shirt I have had for 14 years, I want to say. Uh, it was given to me when I was 18 and did uh, some front of house, uh, well, uh, and I, I did some, some front of house uh, box office uh, FOBO work for uh, a Edinburgh Fringe Festival, uh, an Edinburgh Fringe venue group called C. The letter C. It was, uh, I mean, it, it was, they weren't great, but uh, I had a, a lot of fun because I was 18 and like away from home for a month. Uh, and they let me build theatre spaces, uh, not all of which collapsed. Um, but uh, yeah, it turns out that the t shirt they, they gave me uh, was just ridiculously hardy. Uh, I used to have two, um, one of them vanished at some point but this one has just lasted you know um uh, that shit yeah this shirt is in this t-shirt is in middle school uh and it's just like sometimes i when i reach for a, like a, a dark t-shirt because uh, it's just a, a lounge around the house and a dark t-shirt sort of day or when i'm doing the washing uh yeah i find myself still wearing ask. it yes what is it can the divine air be made to bleed Definitely Why not a creepy question. Do so? mm -hmm. The blood of the divine air is required to obtain the dragon tears from the divine realm. And that feeling when the t-shirt lasts longer than oh, the venue. I'm I not sure, actually. C it might still be going as a, as a, as a concern. Cannot be shed by normal means. However, you currently possess the means to do oh, so. The mortal blade. Yes. Here you are. Immortal severance scrap. With mortal blade in hand, my blood may be shed. With my blood, the aroma will be complete. The divine realm will be in reach. Immortal severance will be at hand. I must ask Tomo to assist with the beheading. Oof, okay. This was written by Lord Takeru? It was. With the mortal blade, you may wound the divine heir, and his blood will be allowed to flow. I see. This brings us one step closer to immortal severance. I shall tell my lord. Of course. To be fair, I do. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm very flippant about like, oh yes, <laughs> what a, what a fun game about helping a child commit suicide. But then again, Lord Kuru is, I think, like canonically very, very old, um, because like it's, it's, it's a weird immortality thing. Wolf, did you speak with Lady Emma? I did. And, what did she say? That it could be possible with the mortal blade. I see. So the mortal blade will allow my blood to flow. As you wish. Hmm. Shall we give it a try? Okay. The mortal blade was never meant to be Yeah, drawn. but you've been drawing it a lot. There is no Scare knowing how it wolf. will affect you. It's... Burning the incense may help protect you from such harm. Yes. If you insist, then that is what we shall do. Okay. Uh, this may be going in a further direction i think first do i i, I want i think i want to get some more rice from the divine child just because i'm it's a slightly weird one i'm feeling i don't remember there's a bunch of different endings to uh to this game and there's one of them that i want to get and i haven't looked i should probably have actually looked up how to get it but i keep not doing but i remember eating a lot of rice is very important for it so every time i run out of rice i'm i'm gonna go back and talk to the other uh, weird immortal child 
Um, and she'll she'll conjure some rice from her palms. Uh, a Kofi from Shay. Happy Friday! I've gotten my old stuffed animals out of the attic, and I was vehemently against naming toys as a child for some reason. So they are nameless. Might I request a name for a plush ram and a manatee? Uh, I mean, oof. It's a little bit cheeky. That is a that is a two for one request on namings. Uh, I tell you what, I'll see how many are on my uh, list, uh, and if I've got if I've got more than twenty in the chamber, I could split. Well, I mean that depends. Like you're rolling the dice. Uh, I'll see how many I've got in the chamber. Uh, quiet, Steve. Um, Uh, so, right, the, um, there are exactly 20 names currently on my list, um, so what I will do, I will do as, as Steve suggested and split one in two. So the full name is, uh, Intellectual Property Rights Violation, um, uh, but, uh, so one of them is Intellectual Property, uh, and the other is Rights Violation, um. I, I will... I'll, let's say that the manatee is intellectual property and the ram is rights violation. That feels appropriate to me. Right, hey kid. Oh, she's asleep. Wake up and give me rice! <clears throat> oh, Shinobi of the Divine Air, I awaited your return. Please, take this rice. Thank you. Bless us with bountiful mm. harvest. You have my gratitude. Of course. Rice is a precious thing. This game is so Remember, into rice. to chew properly before <laughs> swallowing. <laughs> I mean, I laugh, For but uh, that is also advice that I sometimes should bear in mind. Um... Late King of Mars, Johnny, you should make a table and roll for different name com combinations. Uh, I, on the one hand, I see where you're coming from. and the other hand, this the, the name list situation is very much intended to reduce the amount of work uh, it takes for me to name things. And I feel like making a table would substantially increase that amount of work. And the uh, you have to remember, I, I don't, I don't. I don't want to give things good names, or at least I, that's not a consideration. I don't, if I start to be like, oh, I've got to make sure the names are the best they can be, that's that's a spiral of weird perfectionism. Uh, so the names are weird, and I understand that the table might make them weirder, but yes, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Let's stab a child. Well, slice a child, gently. I see you've gathered some of the ingredients. Keep up the good work. Oh, what? Oh. You're leaving, Wolf. My lord. You, I, th I thought I thought you said you wanted me to, to, to cut you up a bit. Do what? Oh. I guess maybe not. I'm glad you've come, Mass. Oh, well, maybe not. Do I have a drink? Yeah, have some monkey booze. Have some monkey booze, Emma. Here. Oh, this is... Yeah. <laughs> this is... Monkey. Yes. Yeah. Something wrong? Well, let me try it. Oh, it, it burns so bad. Let's see. Yes, monkeys. I seem to have a strong what? connection <laughs> with monkeys. Uh, okay. You do? Yes. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I was rescued by a so monkey what? after all. You don't believe me, do you? It's, I... When I was young, I stood alone in the aftermath of a battlefield. I was alone and still. I mean, I've killed a lot of that. monkeys, Emma, so I'm sorry. I could do nothing. Neither cry, nor even get angry. Complete shock. And then there was a monkey eating a rice ball. A monkey? Maybe an ape? Maybe. <laughs> Either way, I mean, he made okay, so okay, well, what? 
I remember being angry at that. But then, then he gave me the rice ball. It tasted so good. What a kind monkey. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is he was a very not the story monkey. I expected. Astral Dawn, he literally unlocked the tragic backstory. Uh, well, to be fair, you unlock various people's tragic backstories by giving them different sorts of sake. Uh, and then they'll be like, oh, here's a story from my tragic past. Um, although she might have been actually talking about the sculptor, because uh, when he was a shinobi, all the sculptors, ha all, all the shinobi have uh, animal names, like wolf or owl or phantom butterfly. And his shinobi name was Orangutan. Uh, so... And Emma and the Emma and, and the sculptor do seem to be friends, so maybe there's some backstory there. Uh, okay, I've got a pre-stream poll. Which totally real metric unit is the best? Brackets one is real. Uh, Veeks brackets vegetables eaten one percent. Uh, Apadukes brackets amount of tea six percent. Cirros. The amount of serotonin in your body at any given time, 7%. Candela, luminous intensity, 12%. Flangi, flanges, concentration of flesh in a given area, 19%. Evups, evups, fucks given. And schmozus, literal weight of cats. Uh, I mean, I know that you do measure luminous intensity and candle power i don't know if that translates to candela but uh I mean, that's one i'm gonna say uh kofi from oscar hi johnny sasha cat steve mods and chat i hope you're all having a good day my good news this week is that i got a new larp sword it is now in need of a name may i ask for one please yes uh it is called difficult train journey um uh, Kofi from Just Vibing. My good news for today, I got my science juice finally. And even more than that, I made a new friend at the vaccine centre somehow, so now I am both microchipped and socialising. Uh, oh, the microchip, as in the the weird vaccine conspiracy thing. For, for, so, for some reason, my mind immediately went, have I received a Kofi from a cat? When you get, you, you get like a cat microchipped. And you went, uh, just, yeah. Uh... Kofi from Shea, intellectual property, the manatee, and rights violation, the ram. Thank you for your service. Also, good news. With my friends and I being vaccinated, we can probably, probably go to Pride again this year, and I am very excited. Hey, Jester says Candela is real. Yeah. Goodbye. Right. So, uh, where are we going? Be into the Guardian Apes Quarter. I guess we're going to the Ashina Depths. We haven't somewhere we haven't been yet, so uh, let's go there. Yeah, I don't super do pride to be honest. Like, I mean, I, I've only ever been like, I've only ever really been to the London one and. It, it's so, just so many people and it's always on an incredibly hot day uh, in places with very little shade uh, and I I'm, I just find hot days and large crowds and standing for hours it's 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 a tough one uh, right rice 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 okay there's definitely some baddos around here question is where they are. Haha. -ha. I'm too secure for your cannon. Oh, hello. Ah. Oh, hello. Mini boss. Oh, it's one to use. 
Ah. Oh. Yikes. Yep, I forgot how to play. Eat the rice. Eat the rice, Sekiro. Ow. Whoa. Right in the shootable bits. Kofi from Obsidian J. Hello all, I've recently bought two moth plushies, one for myself and one for my girlfriend, neither of which have names yet. Could I have at least one name, two if it feels appropriate? Okay. Uh, you know what? I love both of these names, so you can have both of them. Uh, the first is named Metatron Cuddles. Uh, that is Metatron, as in the voice of God, and Cuddles, as in the act of cuddling uh, and the other is saint punch uh, that is saint as in uh, a, uh, a holy fi a holy figure canonized uh, and punch as in b being being punched Don't you look at me. Don't you be looking at me. That's right. Oh, damn it. Quickly die. Yes. Good. Ooh, some scrap magnetite. Lovely. Right, okay, let's let's do this again. Oh, every time. Ouch. Ooh. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, get out the poison, Sekiro! You fool! Don't worry, there's no one here. <laughs> I lied, there was someone there. Ow! Rude. more sound effects than usual, but I don't know if that's actually true, or just... Oh, 
Oh, oh, I can't do dodges when I'm in the poison. Just doing a bit of a bother while you're hanging out in the poison. Come on. Yes, there you go. Lovely. Right. Sorry about that, everyone. Uh, this was just a just a mini boss needed killing uh, before I got onto that second Kofi, and I'm sure you were all you were all very. Uh, 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 I don't know. Um, anyway, uh, Kofi from Mora. Uh, Hi, Johnny et al. Can't be there for the stream today, but good news is I'm hanging out with friends I haven't seen in person in a long time. I hope you all are having a great week and happy start of Pride. Someone throw an F in chat for me when Johnny falls off a cliff. Remaxa 13. Wow. Wow. I was going to I, I was gonna say some lovely stuff. I was going to wish you happy Pride back. I was going to be like, oh, I hope you have a great time with your friends. And then you're like, oh, Johnny's going to fall in a pit. Well, shush. Maybe I'm not, you know? I haven't fallen in a pit yet this stream. Maybe it's not going to happen. Oh. Oh, hey, mate. Dead. <laughs> it's funny because I stabbed that guy. Right. Oh, hello. Oh, have I already... I must have already got this one. It's not a new statue. Pellet, lovely. Uh, I should probably, uh, I should probably rest, get my, uh, get my flasks back. But I'm going to explore a bit more first. What's the worst can happen? Right. Oh, watch out! Watch out, Sekiro! Oh, hello. What's in your hand, Big Buddha? Let's find out. Some scrap magnetite! Right. Jester says that I'm just very passionate about promoting pit crawler, uh, and marketing is important. Uh, it's cool. It's pit crawler, not pit faller. That's that's my imagining of what someone very unkind would say to me, uh, and I've just hurt my own feelings. So, well, so I'm just going back up to the. If I can actually, no, I can't go back. Oh no, can I? Just trying to go back up to rest up because I think. I feel like the next section has some nonsense in that I'm going to want healing for. Oh, can I not? Ah, oh, I can't get up there. Oh, yeah, I can. It's all right, everyone. Everyone can relax. We're all good. Um, <laughs> Condite says the first pit crawler stream, the player did fall in a pit. So, I mean, yeah, well, actually, I don't think Bart... Sash, did Bart in the first pit crawler stream, did Bart fully fall in the pit? Uh, or just like, he almost fell. He almost fell. Like, I th uh, yeah, I, th I thought that. Yeah, he was hanging, he was hanging, but he didn't quite, he didn't quite pit fall. Which I think is an important distinction. Stab. Kofi uh, from Erin. Happy Friday, everyone. Two bits of good news for me. I turned 35 yesterday, and earlier in this week, I finally got a haircut for the first time in three years. So glad to have that literal weight off my shoulders, because, ow, my back. 
Well, happy birthday uh, and congrats on the haircut. That sounds momentous. Oh, hello. Who or what did this to you? Large A on my Oh, neck. good. My neck. <laughs> right. It's another big monkey. Oh, yeah. Right. Okay. Well, let's read some more Kofis before I before I deal with this nonsense. Uh, also, I feel like there's... Yeah, there is There is somewhere else to be before... I thought there was another little section before uh, I had to fight the big ape. Uh, Kofi from uh, Shriyanam. Uh, hello, Johnny, Sasha, Mods, Cats, and Cha... Sorry, I was killing a moth. Um, mods, cats, and chat. My good news is that I'm going to see a movie, brackets Cruella, the theatre for the first time since December 2019. I'm very excited. That does sound exciting. And you know what? I've heard that Cruella's actually a lot of fun. Uh, a Kofi from Probs Not Hawkeye. Howdy, y'all. Good news for this week. I came as non-binary to my sister, and she was very supportive. Still trying to figure out if I'll tell the rest of my family, but I'm happy with this first step. That's lovely. That's wonderful to hear. Uh, Kofi from Onomancers. Hello all. I wanted to announce I'm almost complete with my personal statement, which means I'll be submitting my master's application soon. I'm super nervous and scared I'm going to fumble the ball at the goal line, but I think I've really got a chance. Here's hoping. I've Best of luck, and I'm sure you're going to nail it. Kofi from Miria. Uh, trying again, as my message apparently didn't go through last time. Uh, uh, apparently, uh, we think that if people submit anonymously, um, it doesn't show their message. Um, if you, but if if you don't want a, uh, me to read out your name, just put that uh, like at the start of your of your message, and, and the mods will flag it. Uh, or the, or just put a fake name. Or just put a fake. I, I, yeah, or we'll just put a fake name. Uh, hi all, Kofi to celebrate that I got an A on my thesis, meaning I now have a bachelor's degree in archaeology. Congratulations! I'm so happy and wish you all a spectacular weekend. Please tell your pets hi from me. I will. Uh, they're upstairs snoozing at the moment, um, but I will. Uh, I will let them know. And a Kofi from the Lonely Desolation. Hey Johnny and all, I'm having a fun time chilling with the stream, but I have to leave early for therapy, which is important and good and useful. But I don't wanna, so I maybe so I could maybe get some words of encouragement. Serious or silly, love you all. Yeah, uh, therapy is hard and irritating, and you don't want to have to do it, but it's it's good. It, it is good for you. To, it, it is important, uh, and so yeah, but also just do it. Um, I mean, obviously, your experience of therapy may vary, uh, but that is that is where I'm coming from. So I just have an explore, doing that thing. Oh, hey, monkey! Yeah. More monkey booze! Ah, love to have monkey booze to give to people. Shame I can't give monkey booze to any of the immortal children. They're immortal. They are like if if you know. Just strikes me as funny. They're all like super serene, you know, and holy. And I just think it would be funny if they got a bit, a bit plastered. Yeah, I want to tarnish that. Also, I think, I think Kuru, like Kuru's fun. Like Kuru, Kuru would be game. But of it, but Wolf would never do it. Wolf would be like, hmm, no, and it breaks the iron code. There's no iron code. Not to party. Oh shit, it's the... It's the fucking... Yep. Sorry? Yeah, no, he's, he's headless because of me. Uh, I, I, I beheaded him 
a while. Well, I beheaded him last stream. Ooh. Nope. Put your, put your umbrella on, you fucking dipshit. Not you, chat. I was talking to Sekiro. Oh, I've forgotten how to fight this thing already. Ow. Oh, wow. That really hurt. Okay, well. Look, I'm sorry I chopped your head off, okay? I mean, not actually, because... But... Yes! That's one. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, friends, there's a complication. Because, uh, turns out, he did find, he, he did find a mate. Uh, you know, and it's like, it's, it's quite, it's quite sweet, you know, if a huge terrifying monkey can find love after it's dead, maybe there's hope for all of us. Oh my god, no, I've, yep. Oh yeah, of course, that's probably a good idea. Yes! Lovely. Oh, shit! Okay, alright, alright, alright. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, get out your umbrella, mate. Oh no, I'm out of umbrella. That's bad news. Yeah, I don't think I'm quite making it this time, but... Okay, back up. Oh no, I'm not quite out of umbrella. Oh, ow. Yikes. Oh. Oh, damn it. Do I? Do I? Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Let's go. No, 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 no. Okay, all right, all right, all right, we're good. Oh, shit. No, oh, yeah, prick. <sighs> Joshua Gillespie Stan. Diversity win. The giant undead ape trying to kill you is gay. You know, representation is important, I suppose. Uh, right. Okay. Wow. Uh, Kofi from Alex V. Hi, everyone. Got vaccine today. Also, my computer died during the protagonist stream, but I should get the new parts for it tomorrow. Considering I'm replacing most of it, can I have a name for it? Yep. Your new computer's name is Say Cheese and Die by R.L. Stein. Uh, 
Kofi from Snappy. Hi Johnny, Sasha, Cat, Steve, Mods and Chat. Good news. I had my last exam this week and have finished my first year of uni. Very happy to be on break now, so thank you for the relaxing stream. Congratulations and yeah, hope it's uh, hope it's a nice chill break. And a quote from Diane. Hi, a weird little good a little weird good news from me. This week I saw a real synch synchrotron. In case anyone is wondering, it's huge, round, and buzzing. In addition, the interior of the scientific institute where we were well, was very reminiscent of control, so I remembered your streams a lot. Oh, that's nice. Sorry, I'm just grabbing my Diet Coke. I don't know what a synchrotron is, uh, but I'm very glad that you saw one and that it was everything you dreamed. Oh, balls. Yeah, yeah. Ah, come on! Yes, yes, yes! Oh, look at look at me! I can I can shoot Johnny with a cannon. We can all shoot Johnny with cannons. Ugh! You know what? I'm just gonna die. That'll show him. Right, let's try this again. Oh, actually, I've got three. Uh, I've got three skill points. Maybe I can spend them. Acquire skills. Yes, I'll acquire this skill. I think. Flowing water. Ooh. Why the combat art Ashima Cross? Mm. Interesting. Right then. There we are. See? It's polite to die when somebody stabs you. thing is, I don't remember what happens if I don't kill the monkey up here, but I'm pretty sure. I mean, I, but I, I don't want to find out also, because I feel like it's going to be bad, so I'm just going to kill it. Plus, you know, I need to do a few murders to try and get my... Yes. Oop. Ouch. Oh, oh balls. Forgot about that little trick. Ow. Oh, already? Ah, oh. come on, monkey man. Ah, oh, balls. Come on. Shit, I thought I was out of range. Apparently not. Oh. Okay. 
Hooray! Fortunately, now comes you. Wasting a bunch of fireworks at the moment. Oh, yeah. Ah, well. <laughs> a lot of chat is hearing the violin from Toxic by Britney Spears during this fight. <laughs> uh, I'll be honest, I haven't listened to it late. It's been a while since I've really listened to it. Um, Kofi from Ryu here. Wanted to thank you for naming the Goblin King in my D&D backstory. Long live Lumpy William. The others in the group love it. We are playing our first game next week and I'm really looking forward to it. Gobbo will be the sweetest but most chaotic tank goblin that I could make. That's wonderful. Um, Lumina Nightfall. Hi Johnny, Sasha, Steve, Cats, Mods and Chat. My good news is that I get my first dose of science juice tomorrow. Also, my colleague rescued a hedgehog from the street today, and that is a nice thing I wanted to share. That's lovely. Congratulations to your uh, to your colleague and to the hedgehog that has been rescued. Right. Again! Uh, to Sekiro for your cannon, to Sekiro for your cannon, oh, going to stab you. I'm too secure for your monkey. Too secure for your monkey. Oh, let's get funky. I'm a shinobi. You know what I mean. I'm not to stab you in the neck because you're a monkey. Oh, you're a monkey. Right. Here we go. Oh. oh no! No! Chat! We didn't have our umbrella out! That was going so well! And then... We just didn't pack our umbrella! Steve, I didn't pack my umbrella and I died. And you were right. Yes. Lovely. Ah! That happened quicker than I anticipated. I thought it was a... Ouch. Come on, get up! Ow. Oh, God, okay. The tide has turned somewhat. Ow. Oh, really? oh, damn it. Okay, okay. Calm down, Johnny. Yikes! Oh. Okay, this is. I just need to get like a couple of fucking hits on this. Oh no, this is not. Okay. Still though, I don't think. Oh. oh 
no. I've lost it. Eat a palace and calm down. Get that centipede! Mortal blade! No, kill it with the. Did I, did I do it with the mortal blade? Because I feel like you need. To, no, yeah! There you go. Oh, memory. Headless ape. The headless guardian ape was a colossal beast, plagued with the power of the undying. A couple of prayer beads, lovely. Yes! Immortality severed. Oh, bestowal ninjutsu. Ninjutsu technique that wreathes a blade in the victim's blood, extending its reach. Uses spirit emblems to use, activated after a backstab death blow. The wolf discovered this technique upon beheading a foe with the mortal blade, forming a cursed sword from spilled blood. Though it bears a likeness to the mortal blade, it cannot kill the undying. Okay. Couldn't do a. I got a. I got a magic. I can do a bit of bit of magic ninja sword now. Fun. I might give that. I might give that a try. Oh. What a good fight with a big undead ape. Oh, hello, buddy. All right. Sorry, I've got a got a got a fella. Right. Okay. Sorry, chat. Uh, I'm kind of obliged to uh, fuss this cat slightly. You settling or? Uh... You just pass them through. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I love you too, buddy. Right, I've got to, I've got to get back to the game now. Okay. To be fair, I know that chat don't. Ah, yeah, okay. He's 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 down. He's having a. He's relaxing. So uh, if I uh, if at any point my face contorts in uh, what appears to be pain, uh, it probably will be pain. It will be because uh, a cat has decided to extend his claws into my leg. But he hasn't yet. He hasn't yet. And we did clip his claws relatively recently. So. Hoomst nose. Oh. So wait. I thought there's a way. Can I? Yeah, okay, there we are. Whoop. Up we go. Whoosh. Whoosh. 
What? Ghosts? I forgot there were ghosts. Oh. Ugh, you dicks were hot. Enough of a headache when you were alive. Oh, hey, mate. How's that music treating you? She's gone. But what? she was here just moments ago. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh, Shinobi. Listen. I finally saw her. The Shamisen player was a woman. I only saw her from afar, but I could tell. Look, mate, it's 2021. Shamisen players can be right now. Oh, I should have asked if she was calling to me. And before I knew it, she disappeared. Yeah, pretty sure mist. she's a ghost luring you to your death, but uh, you do you, mate. I can't, you know, anything. Now that I think it over. My father told me stories about a hidden town shrouded deeply in mist. An ominous town. Yep. Don't ever go there, he said. Mm, too late. That doesn't matter to me now. Now there's a thick, misty forest in my way. If only I could figure out how to get through it and find that shamisen player. <laughs> Sorry, there, there was a there was an evil doctor in an abandoned dungeon that was like, please bring me somebody like strapping and healthy, uh, and I just completely forgot that they just give you the choice: lure to abandoned dungeon. Don't mention abandoned dungeon. Uh, I, I'm probably gonna not mention abandoned dungeon. Hmm. <sighs> it's coming from deep in the fog. That melody. <laughs> it's just the me. phrasing. <laughs> uh, Kofi from Bryn. Hello, all. Good news is that tomorrow I finally get to hang out with a friend who I haven't seen since the pandemic started, and I'm very excited. Bummer news is that today's high is 107 degrees Fahrenheit, 41 ish degrees Celsius, and I'm slowly melting. That's ridiculous. I don't know where you are in the world, but. It's too hot. Go, go somewhere colder. Um, oh, yikes! Hope it doesn't get that hot here this year. Like it's it's gotten pretty hot these last few years, but we'll see. We'll see. Uh, Kofi, another Kofi from Mora. Hi again. I won't see this till the vod, but I just found and bought the cutest little tomberry tomberry earrings. Would you be willing to name these two judgmental grudge wielding monsters? Good luck with all of the sneaking and murdering. I get. I'm guessing you are doing. Certainly. Uh, well, they are. Um, I will give. Uh, I'm. I'm running a little bit low on names, so I'll just have. They'll have to share it. Uh, they'll have to share the name. Uh, but their name is Party McDrugs. Uh, that is Party. Uh, a party and uh, muck like a Scottish or Irish uh, uh, what do you call pre uh, surname prefix uh, and drugs uh, as in the, the substances uh, heart's attack power uh, Steve is claiming <laughs> that his high school nickname was party muck drugs and uh, I'll be honest Steve I've I've lived with you for a year now. I, your part, your high school nickname was not Party Book Drugs. Was it an ironic nickname? <laughs> um, at one time, the guardian ape shared its den with a mate, but he alone became infested while the other passed away. Now even the flowers often in tribute to her passing have withered to dust. Oh, sad. Um. And a Kofi from signifying something. Hey everyone, happy Friday. Finished 13 stories and holy crap, it was amazing. Oh, going to recommend it uh, on my book talk for sure. Uh, oh, wonderful, thank you. Uh, even if they usually rip you to shreds on there if you recommend something other than young adult fantasy. It'll be worth it. Have a great weekend. That's a weird... 
that's a weird culture. Like, but I, I, huh? It, I guess it is TikTok. I just. Yeah. Yeah, no, Sasha's just saying that when the the like, when when we were YAs, uh, like we we actually we. I mean, I didn't really read any YA fiction when I was actually a YA. Well, it was like I don't know, like it was there was there, there was some. It it was around. Mm. Uh, Jess says it was thirty six here yesterday, so if I die one of these days, it will be from melting in the heat. Uh, <laughs> in Canada, apparently, yeah. Uh, oh, and uh, Grinnell says Party McDrugs is uh, totally not a cop name. <laughs> of course you can tell me where you're all going, the drugs. Drugs is my middle name. Well, my surname. Sixth prayer necklace. The centipedes will see take out a leader, often changing names out of loyalty. Centipede chiefs are known as long arms for their large talon-like weapons. I suspect that centipedes may be a weird translation of something, because uh, they're those like weird spiky fire ninja things. Okay. Here we are in the old mists. <laughs> Jester says uh, that they're next to the only desert in Canada, which uh, did not know there were any deserts in Canada. Which, oh, oh, ah, ah, chicken, chicken, chicken. It's all right, everyone. It's all right, the chicken is dead. I don't know why it felt so good to triple shuriken a chicken to death, but, but it did. It felt really good, chat. Oh, hello. Oh, who are you? Hey, hey you. <coughs> if you know the path of Buddha, would you slay one who opposes it? One who uh, opposes the Buddha? What Correct. a question. <coughs> The one of whom I speak hides in an abandoned temple up ahead. He sealed away Hi. the village in a shadowy fog so that he can fool the villagers. An abandoned temple? Yes. I've completely forgotten this section. It's of the an game. old building. <laughs> the door may be closed, but there should be a hole in the second floor. I do not remember who this person is that I need to, to murder. But, uh... But you know what? Yeah, you know what? I, I, I nicked that scrap magnetite from Buddha earlier, so it feels only fair that, like, I mess up. I mess up some people who are, who are like, doing him a, doing him a mischief. It is a bit hard to navigate in all this fog, but I think I'm doing all right. A lot of chickens around here. Ooh, that chicken hits hard. Some sort of elite chicken. That looks like a ghost. Can you backstab a ghost to death? Yes. <laughs> they even they they even do a nice spurt of ectoplasm.
Okay. Oh, what was that? What was that? Something dropped down. You you saw that, right, chat? It wasn't just me. Maybe it was just me. Oh. It's a flute. Oh, hey, mate. Ah! Ghost dog! It's fine. Ghost dog is over. How do I get up there? Oh, I think there's a, a way around that I need to take. Oh. Sneak and stab, is your Russian no be sneak and stab? Oop. I don't know where I'm going. It's too much fog. Oh, someone seen me? Oh! Here come the ghost dogs! Oh! And someone's ghost shooting at me. Oh, more ghost dogs! Okay. Ow. This is all. Come on, lock onto the ghost dogs! software love to make you get lost in the woods they love it ow all right all right no need to be a prick oh, look at me i can shoot arrows can all shoot arrows. I can't actually shoot arrows in this game, that is. But if I could. Oh. You. Oh, have I gone in a big fucking circle? I have, haven't I? in the woods. I 
Mm, I know I can't get up there, but I really I feel like I can. I feel like I can get up there, but... Oh, no. no. Ugh. Right. Um... Huh. <laughs> Apparently everyone, uh... Everyone is making my uh, holiday Dracula emote uh, rainbow for pride. Uh, and yeah. Gay Dracula. Big diversity win. What are we... Yes, yes, yes. Aha! Aha! Ha 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 ha! You prick! Yeah! Not so shooting with arrows now, are you? Ugh. You know what I think, chat? And this may be a controversial statement. I think there's too many ghosts. And I don't want to accuse anyone of spoiling my broth. But, oh, you... Oh, oh what? Monkey! Oh, is that another fucking gun monkey up there? Bet it is. Oh my god. One's a mini boss. Let's have a glug. Oh, hey! It's another years. Oh. Ah. Oh, I got cocky because I'm stronger now than when we last, than last time I met one of these mini bosses. But maybe a bit too cocky. Ooh. Where are you? Okay. All right, we're doing okay. Boing. Ooh, oh, wow. Yikes. Okay. You know what? Have some firecrackers, dickhead. Ooh. Oh, no! Oh, I did get too cocky. I did get too cocky. Oh, now there's going to be all those fucking ghosts again. Oh, God. Ugh. Oh no, I felt... Mm. Okay, I don't like being down here. Feels wrong, feels weird, feels bad. Like... I know, t I know it might not be existentially correct to say that all ghosts are pricks, but... You know what? Stereotypes exist for a reason when it comes to ghosts shooting me with arrows. Not even going to repeat that, Steve. Now, can I remember? 
remember which way was the... Yes, I think it was up here. Come on, get up the fucking... Yes, good. Oh, and then there's all the monkeys, but you know what? Let's see. Excellent. Very neat. One stab. Oh, yeah, no good, he didn't get me. Unrefined sake and a prayer bead. Lovely. Lovely stuff. And a fistful of ash because of all them monkeys. And you tend to get fistfuls of ash from monkeys. Maybe that's a metaphor. Maybe monkeys just don't have good loot. And to be fair, like, where would they get money? You know? Hello. A goodie. Oh, a pellet. Hmm. Oh, wait, is this... Ah. Uh... I went to shortcut. couple of uh, Kofi's. Kofi from Rockapan. Hi Johnny et al. Uh, can I have a name for the plush chicken I bought as a present for someone, but then kept for myself? Uh, yes, uh, your plush's name uh, is uh, Rich Uncle Cowboy. So yeah, your plush chicken is called Rich Uncle Cowboy. Uh, and Kofi from Silver Colour. Ooh, a Kofi. For Jester's very, for Jester's very secret squishable plot that Dot Johnny doesn't know about. Mm. Mm. Well, I don't. But also, do bear in mind, uh, Silver Color, uh, the switches, uh, snitches, snitches stop twitches. Yeah. Okay, so what's... who's in here? Okay, that's... That's not an... That's not an... 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 Person. That's an... It looks a bit... Looks a bit off the sea! Mist Noble. Oh, 
Okay, good. Ooh, a lump of grave wax. Used for occultic prosthetic tool upgrades of an advanced nature. Oh, it's gone all misty. Whomst could have foreseen this as the result of murdering a mist noble. That was an underwhelming uh, mini boss fight. Oh, goodness, this place is a lot worse than I thought it was. Oh, because while he played, it was all beautiful and lit up, and now he's dead. It turns out it is revealed as a as a burned out a, a burned out husk of a place. I'm a burned out husk of a man. That's there's a difference. Let's have a look. Now there's no ghosts or mists or nonsense. To be fair, looks like without the ghosts and mists and nonsense, there's not a lot going on. I think yeah, this is the way I came. Might go back, have a look what that early area is like without the mist. So hang on, according to this guy, was was it like... So that Mist Noble, I assume, is the one who was like opposing the Buddha. Does that mean like... Aliens are the enemies of Buddha? I've gotten terribly old. But you can say. This old man would like to see Lord Buddha return Sorry? to his temple once mm. more. Oh. Oh, it's a headless. Hello. Hey, hey mate. How, how, how you doing? <laughs> Sash thought that the headless was wearing a top hat really low. Uh, he's, he's not. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, I've got a bunch of pacifying agents. Maybe I'll, maybe, I'll, maybe I'll give it a try. Maybe I'll give it a try. Okay. Oh, I should... I forgot to put on divine confetti. It's, is it too late? It might be too late. How much divine confetti do I actually have? Uh, oh, okay, a little bit, a little bit. Ooh. Oh, okay. Well, I immediately died of terror, uh, which is not not the ideal, but ow. Yep, he's he's pretty terrifying, TBH. Where is he going? Oh yeah, there you are. Ow. Nope, died again. Tell you what, I, I don't like these things. I'm going to go out on a limb and say, down with them. Uh, Vila Captain, you know it's a wife if Johnny kills it very quickly. I, are you referring to the headless? I mean, f like, fair enough. If if that's what if that's what motors your boat, but uh, I mean, yeah, God, Godspeed. Maybe maybe you're maybe you're talking about the Mist Noble. Um, okay, divine confetti, mantra pacifying agent. Let's go. Ow. Ow. Oh, you run already? He comes up behind you because he wants to steal your spine. Ow. 
now. Oh, damn it. Ugh, don't run yet. Coming up behind you. Yeah, I know you are, mate. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Oh, I'm gonna get you. Oh, he, oh my divine confetti's run out and all. Okay. Okay, we're good. Oh! Oh, okay. Well, he almost did get my spine that time. Yes! Oh, right in the stump. Ooh. Gaichin's spirit fall. Fallen, headless spirit of Gaichin suppresses sound and presence, makes the user harder to detect, consumes spirit emblems to use repeatedly. Headless are the ruined form of corrupted heroes who once fought for their country. I'm falling to pieces, said the man to himself, drifting deep into the forest. Sorry? You, th you know, you're right. Oh, I'm falling to pieces! The man said as he entered the forest. You are right, Steve. Something seems to have affected you. I think I might have broken Steve's funny bone. It was just a silly voice, Steve. Yeah, chat did mean uh, missed wife. Uh, St Steve, so no head, throws phone aggressively. Uh, just vibing six. Johnny, you did not kill the headless, the headless killed you. I know, and then I killed the headless. Uh, riot control camp. If that's what motors your boat has taken first place in my least f for my least favourite idiom. <laughs> Formerly, this was occupied by. I'm tasting what you're spitting. <laughs> well, thank you for giving me that one because uh, yeah, I'm, I'm using that one. Uh, but uh, yeah, I don't know where if that's what motors your boat comes from. Uh, but I feel like it's. I, f I feel like it's. It's established in my brain now, so it's not going anywhere. The chickens haven't gone anywhere because they weren't ghosts. Oh, chop! Chop! Stab. On we go. Alon's forward. In many ways, this whole this whole place feels a bit more sinister now that there's no mist. It's just empty, desolate. Pellet. Nice. Hmm. Hmm. I feel like there's... I feel like there's... Enemies... Around here. Yep. Ow. Yes, yeah, yeah, alright, alright. We can all throw shurikens. Stab. Ok. 
Okay. You know what I hate about ghosts? No money. You know? And like, I know what you might, I know what you're thinking. You're like, Johnny, what are you, capitalism? But like, maybe capitalism's got a point about ghosts not having money. You know, because fundamentally, like, while, because uh, I mean, fundamentally, I, 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 w I want to kill ghosts and get their money. And I don't think that. Steve just, uh, and I quote Steve here, you need to be looking for apparitions. Apparitions. I'm going to learn some hand-to-hand some -hand stuff, just, just for fun. What's this? Virtuous deed. Ooh, more money. Hmm, that's nice. So how does this work? Thump, thump. Yeah! Ooh, that feels... Feels good. Some weighty punches. Oh, hello, mate. Care to purchase an offering? Yes, Another please. One. Where you find the departed, you'll find the memorial mob. Even those who can't die still have use for offerings. Mm. Go ahead, buy an offering. This <laughs> this voice actor really reminds me of Mark Hamill. He really does. What you got for me then? Uh, ooh, the purple gourd. Yes. Even though I have just, even though I've, I've just beaten a headless. The purple gourd uh, basically Where is. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Uh, is basically really good. It, it helps you alleviate terror, which is good because terror just kills you. Oh yeah, I don't have that much money because, as I said before, ghosts don't carry money. Care to? Well, yeah, like I guess like the queen. Uh, okay, okay. This is being broadcast and recorded, so I'm really going to have to ask you to stop talking about the question of is the Queen a ghost, because I really don't want MI5, uh, like, yeah, just, just... MI... Ghost... I mean, I was I was about to say M I B, but that but that which but that that is that's the Men in Black, uh, which which do, which sort of makes sense, but it makes too much sense for it to actually work as a joke, right? Anyway, I've sold all my sugar, uh, and so I'm gonna buy some stuff, buy a gourd, buy some tasty sake, a bottle of crystal clear sake. Sake is a drink meant for sharing. A top shelf sake brewed by the Ashina Brewmaster with water from the Dragon Spring. The pure water extracts every last bit of flavour from Ashina's finest rice. <laughs> Again with the rice. There are no words that can do the flavour justice. To understand, one must taste it for themselves. May the departed rest in peace. Oh, well, speaking of, I'm going to go back to that child and get more rice. Because I'm pretty certain, I'm like 90% sure, one, the ending that I want to get kind of relies on me eating a lot of rice. <laughs> Just do the voice again. Steve said it would kill him if he heard it again. <laughs> Revenge for the puns. I, I, I'll be honest, I don't actually remember exactly what the voice was. It was like some... Oh. Oh, no. 
You all right? I'm glad you've come. Shinobi of the divine air. Oh no. Is everything all right? What's wrong? It is nothing serious. More importantly, <laughs> I your rice. I don't I don't know if my rice is more important. Hold on. You don't look well. Rest. Yes, I understand. What can I do? What? Is there something I can get you? Well, then then I like to eat a persimmon. All right. I think I have a persimmon. You've come to visit Shinobi of the Divine Air. I'm not sure if I've ever eaten one. I know we've had them. <laughs> Give persimmon. Keep persimmon. <laughs> just I've, yeah, I know. I'm, I'm obviously. I'm, obviously, I'm gonna give it. I just enjoy that it gave the option of just like, no, don't give it. To just keep eat. it. Yes, thank you. Munch, munch, munch. It's sweet and delicious. Good. Okay. Shinobi, <laughs> Good. hold out your hand. But. No need to hesitate. Hold out your hand. All right. A bountiful harvest for you. Rice. I thank you, Shinobi of the Divine Air. The crop is plentiful, thanks to the persimmon you gave me. I ask that you also give some to the Divine Air of the oh. Dragon's Heritage. I will. Rice for Kuro! Rice that is spilled forth from the hand of the Divine Child of Rejuvenation, intended to be a gift for Kuro. Rice is precious. I want nothing more than for the Divine Air of the Dragon's Heritage to get better. Kuro would likely be pleased to receive it. Let's give Kuro some rice! <laughs> Maddie says the Queen, the first actual weekend at Bernie's puppet. Weekend at Lizzie's. To be fair, it wouldn't be difficult. You just need to you just need to get the wrists. You just need to, to like get the wrist to go. Cause the rest the rest of us are so still anyway. Wolf, you're back. I am. I have something for you, Lord Kuro. Something for me? Here. Yeah. Give rice to Kuru. This? Okay. It's rice. Yes. What? Don't sound so dismissive. The divine child of Simpo Temple told me to give this to you. She did. Then I am grateful. This looks like good rice. <laughs> Each grain glistens. It is sweet when you bite into it. Bite? Wolf. <laughs> rice tastes a lot better when cooked. My lord. Hmm. So, so like Wolf's just been eating raw oh, rice. Eat anything. Which means you don't dislike sweets, then, right? Oh, Let me poor Wolf. Nice for you. Something. Oh nice. no, Wolf. <laughs> You'll have to wait and see. <laughs> Something nice to eat. That's. Oh, that's tragic. I'll make something nice. Some. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, I'll. I'll... You're leaving. Wolf. My lord. I'll I'll just go I'll just I'll just go do some more murders while you cook me a delicious treat because Sekiro has never eaten cooked rice. Oh, hello. Oh, it's one of you. It's one of you lot. Ah, oh, no, sneaking up's not really an option. Unless. Ah! Oh! oh! He's got some poison! He's a. Ow! Oh, 
Oh yeah, I remember that trick that I learned from... Ah, step on your leg. Yes. Ooh, a treasure carp scale. No, this was a dead end. Just had to kill him to get some get some goodies. Oh. I hear I hear Doggers. Dogs. Not doggers. <laughs> That's something very different. Is there anything up here? Oh, yep, yeah, apparently so. Right at the end there is a light coin purse. Oh, okay, well. Oh. And a lump of fat wax. What's that? What's that noise? What are you? Mm. Now, on the one hand, you do seem to just be washing your stuff. So you know what? I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna say hello. Nope. I just thought, just this time, Wolf's not going to be a legit murderer. And no, like. Sure enough, they they attack. Oh, what is? Oh! Oh, do these guys have to die twice like the ones in the... Oh, now they got lumps on their back, which is... a bit odd. Interesting. Interesting. Oh. Well, that's a lot of, that's quite a lot of folks, actually. I might. Oh wow, one of them's got a, a big nonsense. This has got some. This has got some weirdly Resident Evil vibes to it. Oh.
killing all the villagers. Da, 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 da. like that old James Bond movie, the weird villagers trying to murder you, only live twice. Oh, we're almost at the end. Oh, no, he, he, he vanished first time. At some point, I get the I get the ability to dive underwater. I don't know when that is. just rising up out the ground like mushrooms like no steve i'm not even going to i'm not even going to it's too obvious oh oh hey buddy are you are you all right basket 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 okay basket mm -hmm. hi Basket. I. Oh. Hey. <laughs> basket. Calm down. You. Are you an honorable person? Yes. <laughs> Thank goodness. Are we? You are an honorable person. <laughs> Is there something you want to ask? Look. Sorry, but uh, if you have questions, I'll have to answer with this basket on my head. <laughs> okay. What is wrong with this village? I'd sure like to know that, too. Before I knew it, everyone had gone insane. For a while, I, too, was in a daze, but I snapped out of it after I uh, threw up. <sighs> I was thirsty, so I drank a lot of sake. I'm sure that's what made me throw up. The head priest sometimes treats us to sake. But you know, when you drink sake, you get thirsty. The sake cask runs dry in no time. So everyone has no choice but to drink the water in the ponds and rivers. Uh. But the more you drink it, the thirstier you get. Oh. You get thirstier and thirstier. Can't ever drink enough. Right. What is wrong with the villagers? Mm -hmm. No idea. All I know is they all fear Ooh, fire. That's good to For know. a while, I too was in the same days. And I felt the fear too. An unquenchable fire. Even now, the thought of it gives me chills. An unquenchable fire. The hunter, Inuhiko, started burning pine resin and locked himself in his house. His pine resin burns a long time. It's a real nuisance. Inohiko is the village outcast. He likes eating wild animal meat in the sort. That's why the head priest doesn't give him any sake. Where is Inohiko's house? Oh, uh, on the other side of the pond. Inohiko's is the last house on the path. Tell me about the priest. Oh, he's the most important person in the entire village. You can find him in the shrine all the way up the riverside, near the water's source. He told us, let us become citizens of the palace. If you drink enough sake, you shall become citizens, he said. Huh? That's... A citizen of the palace? I don't really get it, but that's what he said. Yep. Oh, gotta go, huh? I'll be here, hiding in this basket. You must resist drinking. Well, I'll, I'll be honest. There is 
very little. I ah, oh, Wolf's Wolf has some impeccable comedy timing. I just love basket, 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 basket. Hey, <laughs> it's just mm, impeccable. Chef's kiss. What's in here? More basket men? Nope. Oh, a fistful of ash. Wonderful. So, oh. Oh, hey, mate. Wah! Chicken! Oh, he's, he's, he's got me! Oh, they grab you as you, you... Oh! They grab you as they come up the ground! Okay, this is... Actually... Okay. Right. Get off me! Oh, a gourd seed! Lovely! Give that to Emma. Get a, get a bit more gourd water with whatever tasty treat. Oh, what is... Something went bong. Oh, it's one of yous. Nobody put Sekiro in a bell. Ow, ow. It's all right. Ouch, okay, all right, all right, all right. You. You were like a, like a, like a witch. Right. Oh, I'm hearing fewer. Oh, maybe she was the one conjuring up all them. All them dudes. Yeah, must have been. Must have been. Oh, hello. Not all them dudes then. Some divine confetti, some yellow gunpowder. around here. Nothing. Nothing around here. Oh, a statue. Good, good, good. Right, let's see what tasty treat Kuro's got for us, and then I think that'll probably be it for this stream. Robot Hell Manager, local drunk men Local drunk man wife's basket gives exposition.
basket, 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 mushroom, mushroom from Space Ranch, yes. I too am of that very specific micro generation. Sorry to keep you waiting, Wolf. Come now, hold out your hand. My lord. Sweet rice ball. Sweet sticky rice made by Kuro using rice from the Child of Rejuvenation. Slowly grants medium vitality recoverment and constant posture recoverment over time. Once when Wolf was starving, his father wordlessly handed him a rice ball. It was astoundingly delicious. This one is sure to taste just as good. What is... Sweet sticky rice balls. I made them with the rice from the Divine Child. Eat it. Don't be shy. It's a sweet eat it. Oh, but Will it gives me... Wolf. My lord. It gives me stamina recovery over time. It's, it's a useful item. But no, he asked me to eat it. So I will eat it. This Ooh. is very good. <laughs> that it is. That it is. How was the rice ball? It was delicious. I bet it was. Ever since I was little, I've enjoyed making sweets. I used to always sneak into the kitchen back at the Hirata estate. Maybe one day I'll open up a tea house if I ever have the time. I, isn't this whole mission so that you could you can die? It's it's fine. It's fine. I tea house. I've gathered some of the keep oh, up yeah. the good. Okay, cool. You're leaving. Well, My lord. That was nice. Wasn't that nice? Let's go check in on the, the Divine Child of Rejuvenation. Thank her for the rice. How you doing, kid? Did you give the rice to the Divine Heir? Yes. He made rice balls out of it. The divine heir of the dragon's heritage? He made them himself. Yes. And he was enthusiastic. And I had one. It was very good. <laughs> That's good to hear. Oh, I see. He may be the divine heir of the dragon's heritage. But Wolf is just he's kind still of human playing matchmaker all. between two in, two immortal children. Of course he is. I am sure he had his doubts about severing immortality as well. Yet even so, it is the path he chose. There is something I would like to ask you, Shinobi of the Divine Heir. Yes? What is his name? Lord Kuro. Lord Kuro. It has a fine ring to it. I should like to meet him someday. Lovely, but can I get some more like Shinobi, just you are normal rice? Oh, have another persimmon. I've brought a persimmon. Oh my! Eat it. Yes, I will. <laughs> <laughs> munch, munch, munch. <sighs> There's nothing quite like a persimmon. Nothing is so delicious. I see. Wolf's like, mm, what about that sweet rice ball? That was pretty delicious. I apologize, the oh. rice is not yet ready for harvest. I know, fair enough, fair I enough. I shall give you more when the harvest is complete. Well, that's, Farewell, that's fair. Shin may the harvest be plentiful wherever your path may lead. Right, and with that, I think I'm probably going to call it for this stream. Uh, I'm just going to check any final kofis. Nope. So, thank you all very much for joining me. Uh, for this, the latest instalment of Johnny stabs ghosts and eats cooked rice for the first time in his life. Oh, wolf, wolf, 
Wolf is so sad. Uh, and Kuro, it's all it's all pretty tragic. It's all pretty tragic. Um, but don't worry, chat. I am shooting for the least tragic of the endings. Um, so, uh, like one of the weirder endings, but the least tragic. So, thank you all for joining me. Uh, are we raiding anyone, Maddie? Is it downfall night? Uh, just trying to think if there's anything uh, I need to plug. Uh, uh, Finn said it was down. Why? Okay, brilliant. One second. Oh, actually, is it this? No, okay, so um, uh, Sunday, Jane Austen Book Club as normal, and uh, myself and Sash will uh, be playing part two of uh, Pit Crawler. Uh, what was it? Was it the assassins above the tomb or something like that? No, no, Necromo's there. Necromo's there, um, and so are some skeletal assassins. It's all going down. Um, we'll be playing the second part of that adventure in Pit Crawler, uh, and the following week, the following Monday, we are going to have some guests from Black Armada, uh, who publish uh, Last Fleet and Lovecraft Desk. Uh, and uh, a bunch of other very cool games and we're going to be having a game uh, of uh, Lovecraft F's, Lovecraft Desk second edition uh, which is a sort of cosmic horror storytelling game that's like it is it's called Lovecraft Desk because it's Lovecraft Desk but not but quite deliberately uh, not Lovecraft uh, and very excited to have them on and uh, be playing again because they're going to be releasing second edition soon so uh yeah look forward to that uh now i believe uh, i believe that's also we are going to raid finn because they are playing downfall they're playing their actual play of spire which is really fucking cool oh come on Raid. Then, then. Boom. Okay. Oh, uh, the raid phrase is. C cook your rice? No, mm, that feels weird. Uh, delicious rice. No. Delicious persimmon. Delicious persimmon. Uh, and I look forward to everyone trying to spell persimmon under pressure. Bye!